everyone. Welcome to tonight's recap of Hell's Kitchen. Well, last time on Hell's Kitchen, Holly and Jay practically did it in the hot tub. Yeah, other people use that. And Jason was sent home. Maybe he can finally get some sleep now because it always looked like his eyes were closed. Yeah, well, now we're down to the final four. And Ben continues to be a doucher. I hate that guy. I effing hate him. All right, so the challenge this week... Um, it's a little bit of a mix-up because Ramsey cooks for them. He switched it up on them. He's making them some monkfish, which isn't the easiest thing in the world to cook or butcher. So they're going to have to recreate his dish by teaching it to some bachelors. Yeah, and these guys have zero experience. They had like zero personalities, too, pretty much. So they have half an hour and verbal instructions only. No touching. Hand check. It's like prison. Yeah. <laughs> what a cluster these guys were. Oh. The one uh, guy was like, was I supposed to wash my hands? Yes. What? Are you a human being? I don't care disgusting. if you can't cook. Are you a human being? <laughs> I know. All right. So Autumn and her little reprobate, uh, the fish was shredded. They ended up with one little perfect slice of fish. Yeah. Which was a shame because it was really good. Jay, well done. Ben, your person's peppers were raw and the pancetta was burnt yep holly's bachelor was like he didn't know what he rude. was doing he, he was, was like rude too. oh take your time chef take your time he was a little bit of a smart ass and it was well done so <laughs> i guess maybe that's what kept him from winning because jay's guy won mm-hmm so the bachelors got themselves a Ramsey cookbook. Woohoo! Bet he doesn't have a stack of those waiting somewhere. And the losers get to fix everything in the kitchen and clean the parking lot. Ooh. And prep, because that's a given. They always have to prep the kitchen. All right, so Jay, for his reward, got to pick someone to bring with him. Now he's thinking to himself, do I bring my boyfriend or, or do my I bring girlfriend? Exactly. <laughs> So, in the end, I guess he was feeling a little heterosexual. So Pose he brought before bros. <laughs> yes. So he brought Holly. Wise choice. I don't think Ben would have been a lot of fun on the blimp. Because he's a doucher. All right. So, then he makes the mistake of telling Ben right in front of Holly that he was going to choose her. But no, he wants... he said... I mean, that he was going to choose picked Ben. I you, but yeah. I had to return the favor for last time. Yeah, sure. That was so effed up. He said that right in front of her, too. That was so cold. All right, so, yeah, they're going on the Goodyear's blimp. Ah! Goodyear's blimp. And they fly over Hell's Kitchen, and the sign was like, Hey, losers, hope you're enjoying your punishment, because I'm sure they were. Mm. It was a double punishment for um, Ben, though, because he got to be stuck with Autumn as yeah. well as doing all the work. Well, he was really jealous about whatever his name is, picking Holly. <laughs> Jay Bird. <laughs> yeah, so he was like, I don't think anyone else has the passion for cooking like I do, and Holly's he a little trap. He says tramp. that about everyone. I'm so tired of him thinking that he's got, he's cornered the market on passion yeah. for cooking. <sighs> How do you know how much passion everyone else has? He needs a good swift boot up his ass. That's what he needs. All right, so this time for the first time ever in Hell's Kitchen, they get to pick their own stations. So Chef's giving them enough room to hang themselves. Yes. All right, JP, open up Hell's Kitchen. So Autumn, right off the bat, sends some raw fish to the pass. But the weird thing is that wasn't even her station. No. Uh, Then... Holly sent out some perfect scallops, which she was complimented for, but then her John Dory was raw. Ben, why don't you speak? Speak, Ben, speak. He why does he answers. never talk? It's so annoying. I want to slap him in the freaking face. Yeah, everyone else is trying to think too, but the whole point of the kitchen is that you have to speak. Autumn on the garnish station wasn't happening. She Cold was spinach. holding greasy spinach. Ugh. Ben, your Wellington's raw. Yeah. So there were some bumps in there, but once they got into a groove, it was great. It was all good. No food was sent back to the kitchen. Can you believe it? I cannot even (laughs) believe it. Best service of the entire season, says Ramsey. So it must be so. The bad news is he ain't looking for four chefs. No. So somebody's going to have to go. And Jay, you did great. So you get to pick two nominees. <laughs> well, he was really stressing out because, again, boyfriend, girlfriend. 
and Autumn. Obviously, he was picking uh, yeah, Autumn to be nominated. That was a given. Uh, why are you stressing out, though, Jay? Think about it. Ramsey always picks who he wants to pick anyway, so you just better pick truthfully. Don't try and play any political games. So Jay picks Autumn and Ben. Which is probably the right choice. It was the right choice, I think. But Ramsey's all freaked out. It's a tough decision. He doesn't want to send anybody home, but he really wants to send Ben home because he said it was a tough decision. You know, have to, to tell him, him that no one's going home this Get week. back in line! All right, so the families are waiting. I always love when they show the families because you kind of get more insight into who the person actually is. And what the hell was up with Holly's baby daddy? I don't know. He was looking to reconcile with her, I think. He was trying to hang all over her. And, like, and she was just like, just give me my kid. <laughs> it was very cold. All right, so next time... Two are actually going home, and I don't think they know that yet. Although he said, I'm turning up the heat. I mean, yes, figure it out, kids. And Ben, health issues? Till next time, much, much love. love.